Breaking right now at noon, a UCF student accused of keeping a fully automatic AR-15 in his car on campus is now under arrest. Thanks for joining us. I'm Justin Warman. And I'm Bridget Ellison. The 19-year-old told police he knew using the device was illegal but said, quote, he does not like laws. News 6's Jerry Askin joins us live from UCF in Orange County. Jerry, police say anonymous tips led to this discovery and arrest. Bridget, Justin, yes, police chief saying a uh, crime line tip led to the finding of 19 year old Max Chambers who attends UCF and lives in Tower 3 here on campus. And I spoke to uh, police chief Carl Metzger here in the past hour for a separate story, uh, but turns out he'll be addressing the media at 2 p.m. on this case. Now, here's a picture we have for Max Chambers. He was arrested Tuesday. Police say for having a modified AR-15 inside of his car at dorm room at dorm Tower 3. He's a sophomore. Engineering major had arrested on felony charges of having an assault rifle that made it fully automatic. Now, police saying he also had knives and was also manufacturing a separate accessory for his gun, all of which police say was against housing and campus policy. And those add-ons, I'll tell you, were banned in Florida here since October. And right now we're asking why this gun, why the guy had the gun to begin with. The chief saying at this time no threat was posed to campus and the student is now banned from campus. The chief saying if you see something to say something. Again, he's having a presser here at 2 p.m. Of course, we'll be here and let you all know what happens. And coming up all new at 4, we're finding out that UCF police actually talked to Max Chambers um, last year, they say, for having a gun on campus. I'm working these stories today from all angles, beginning on News 6 at 4. We're live at UCF. I'm Jerry Askin, getting results, News 6.